Ooh, he looks, ooh, he looks nice. Hello and welcome back to the channel. My name is Clayton and this is Clayton FM. And today I've got a video of something that I kind of stumbled across in my Twitch save. I do live stream over on Twitch, twitch.tv forward slash Clayton FM on a Wednesday, a Saturday and a Sunday at the moment. And I'm doing a Hereford FC save. So I stumbled across this treasure chest, this gold mine, and I wanted to share it with you in case it was useful in your own saves. Now, I know lots of you are doing lower league saves at the moment because they're pretty popular and, you know, you start low and aim high and build your way up and you get those nice long-term saves. They're really rewarding, really good fun. If you're doing that type of save, this video might well be relevant to you and I want you to go and try it and see, see how it works out for you because I think it might be a thing, you know. There is a club that is full of regens, new gens, that are brilliant if you're doing a lower league save, especially if you're doing a lower league save in England. Now, that club is TNS in Wales, the New Saints. And from my own experience and speaking to a few other people, they seem to be super stocked with great regens that are really, really cheap. Now, I'm trying to work out the exact reasons for these, but first, let me show you a few of the players that I have found at TNS across a range of different saves. And I've tried this a few times. Each time, they're really cheap and they seem to be pretty good. Okay, so here we are on the Hereford save, which is my current Twitch save. And we're in season two here. And in the summer window, you see in August here, I made three signings from TNS in Wales. If I click on TNS, you see here's their profile here. They are the best team in Wales. They are predicted to finish first in the top division, the Premier League in Wales. They've got the most money, the best facilities, all of these things. However, they still play in Wales, which is why I think they produce some of the best regens but are still pretty cheap. During the summer, they did have some regens produced over at TNS. One of them was Tom Holgate. Now you might look at Tom Holgate here and think, is he that special? But remember, this is for a lower league save. I picked up Tom Holgate for 7.5 thousand pounds. I probably could have got it cheaper, but I was so excited by the fact that we could bring him in. He's 16 years old and already two and a half stars for the first team with loads of potential up here that you see. Already got attributes that are comparable to some of the players that I already have in my team. Let's compare them to a first team player. Let's go for a midfielder. Let's go for Louis Watson, who is a first team player. You see here, you see, there's not that much of a difference between the two of them. Obviously, Louis Watson's going to be a little bit better. He is four years older and he's starting in my team. But look, Tom Holgate's got better defending. He's quicker. Same physicals, same mentals overall here. Just lacking a few of these things. But Tom Holgate is going to get a lot better. He's so young that he will improve. I picked him up so cheap and he's already got the quality to be a first team footballer. In a few years time, I will make money on Tom Holgate. Or he's going to be a player that's starting in my team. For a lower league save, the ability to bring in young players and then make money of them is, is vital. It's what can make or break your save. And it can really catapult you up those divisions. So this is why I'm sharing with you. Go and check TNS out. The New Saints in Wales. Check them out. Because I'm sure that you can find some hidden gems there that you can bring in so cheap. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to load up a few different saves to show you the types of players that do generate at TNS. And I can show you how you can bring them to some of these lower league teams. So here's one. Mason Page I've just loaded up. And this is a player that's just come through the TNS youth intake. He's an attacking midfielder with tens in lots of different places. Fantastic balance. 5 foot 11, the pace is an issue here, but this player, if you bring him in, will definitely make money. Let me show you how you could bring him in. I've added myself as a manager for Exeter. Let's offer him a trial and see how they rate him, and let's see if we can bring him in. Right, he's in on trial. He's already one star for the first team with four stars, maybe five stars in terms of his potential. Mason Page, let's make an offer for you. What, what kind of money would they want? £450 is his value. Again, 8K. 8k for this player, that is a bargain. Let's say 5k, they would accept 5k. For a player that is already one star for the first team at 16 years old, they're going to get themselves a bargain. Especially, remember as well, they don't sign this contract until they turn 17 years old. So if you've got a 15 year old, that's two years where you're going to be paying them £5 per month on a youth contract. Just remember that too. They want £150 per week. Really, really cheap. And for a player that you are going to make money on. My theory, by the way, for why these great regens turn up at TNS, but they're really cheap still, is that 
Wales have obviously quite a good youth rating in the game, so they produce these good young players. But the teams that they're being produced at, most notably TNS, because they are the top team in Wales, their reputation is still so low that you can still get these players really, really cheap. So there's a misalignment with the youth rating and the reputation of the teams, meaning you get good players, but for cheap prices. That's at least my theory, and I think it kind of holds up. All right then, on the screen behind me here, you can see a few of the other players that I did manage to find and a few people have sent me that they've managed to find at TNS. Some brilliant players, frankly, and so cheap to bring into your club. So if you are doing a lower league save, especially if you're doing a lower league save in England, where you know work permits and things like that make it really difficult to bring in players from afar. It's more difficult to bring in those wonder kids. This could be the saviour. Go and check out TNS. There's probably one or two other teams. I've brought in a regen from St. Pat's in Ireland, for example, who also looks really good. I'm sure there are other clubs. If you know any more, get them down in the comments below. And also let me know if you do find any really great players from TNS using this method, let me know down in the comments because that would be really great to see. But yeah, that is where we're going to end today's video. Hopefully this is useful, like I said, especially if you're doing one of those lower league saves. Before you do go, let me remind you, I do live stream over on Twitch on a Wednesday, a Saturday and a Sunday. Those are the days at the moment. It's twitch.tv forward slash FM. We are doing a lower league save ourselves. We are Hereford FC. We're into season two and we're continuing from there. It's going pretty well, actually, season two. There will be an update video on the channel coming pretty soon to, uh, to get you caught up if you're new over here here um, but also make sure you do subscribe to the channel like the video you know leave some comments down below turn the bell on so you get notified about future videos and most importantly have a lovely rest of your day i'll see you very soon bye bye he, he might have big nuts i don't know i've never seen them